Hey, Karina here, coach and mentor for highly sensitive people and creator of the program, Synchronize Your Life. Welcome to this week's Wednesday Wisdom as I share with you on how to not feel guilty when letting go of a toxic relationship. This topic can also relate to any sort of relationship that is simply ready to finish. It is ready to end. Sometimes we think, you know, as human beings, we get really attached to people. And we think that someone should be in our life for forever. But the real truth is that, I heard this saying a couple times, that people come into our life for a reason, a season, or a lifetime. And I would say the people who come in for the lifetime, they are there because of many reasons. There are many things to teach us. So the wisdom I want to share with you, the question I want you to ask yourself to go within to explore is this. Why did this person come into my life to begin with? So there's this quote. And every time I hear it, it literally makes my heart explode because it, because it is so true. This quote says that nothing goes away or no one goes away until it teaches you what you need to know. So if there's someone that even though you've closed the door on them and for whatever reason they keep looping back around, okay, or they keep opening up that door, they keep sending you messages and over time and time again, you have to keep telling them, go away, I don't want you in my life or, you know, this relationship is over. I want you to sit back and ask yourself, what is the reason that they came into my life to begin with? Everything in this world is energy. We have to admit that. And as highly sensitive people, you have the ability to tune into the energy. Now, let's listen to the energy. If the energy is constantly is bringing them back in, you want to understand why they're coming back in. Okay? Because here's the thing, this is what happens. Even if you end that relationship and even if you know, it's, it's done and it's gone. If you did not learn the lesson, if you did not receive the wisdom that you were meant to learn from that relationship, that sacred contract, then guess what? The universe is going to send you another person to make sure that you get the wisdom down, that you receive the lesson. Sometimes even the universe sends you one person or two after that to make sure that it is deeply learned in you, okay? Because the whole idea is that we're here to break patterns and other people help us show our patterns. Other people are the best teachers. That's why I love people and that's why I am so fascinated by relationships because there's so much that we're here to learn by seeing our relationship to others, the way they interact with us, and the way we respond to them. So by taking on this perspective that other people are teachers for us, other people have things to teach us about ourselves, then we can move through and break our patterns with more joy and better flow. Now, Here's the next piece. If you are still struggling with setting boundaries, with maybe saying no to things that don't serve you, or saying yes to things that will serve you, or even just being confused in general and seriously doubtful that you can um, create these boundaries in a healthy way, or you can leave this person or find your strength even without this person that you've been depending on for so long, then I'd love for us to connect one-on-one for a clarity session. Here's the thing, I only have three spots left for August. So if you want one of these spots, follow the link in this video, connect to this video for the clarity session form. When I receive your form, I will send you an email back so that we can set up a time to connect. This clarity session will give you the space. It'll be a sacred space for you so that you can talk about your challenge. Maybe it's around boundaries, maybe it's around something else. And by the time you leave the session, you will have clarity on what your next best steps are. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Maybe leave a comment below, tag someone, tag a friend. And if you aren't already in the A Place for Highly Sensitive People Facebook group, join me there because that is where the action's happening. Okay, and if you're already, if you're seeing this in the group, invite your friends. Is there a friend that you think would benefit from having a community such as us so that they can grow and learn just as you are? Thank you so much for connecting with me today. I will talk to you next week. Have a great rest of your day. All right, bye-bye.